Two things that I really love are spending time with my family and traveling. This summer I got to do both. My parents, they celebrated the 50th wedding anniversary. Instead of having a big party, the whole family took a trip together to Yellowstone National Park. This was quite exciting for me because I have never visited this national park. Our journey began when the family met in Lubbock. We all piled into a 15-passenger van for a 24-hour road trip. Talking about getting to know your family, my brother and sister-in-law also drove a truck. 20 people total. We spent a lot of time talking and laughing. The younger ones, they sat in the back and played games. We took two days to travel with lots of restroom breaks. Although I was still in class, I was not worried because the house that we rented had internet, so I continued to work on my class throughout the week. However, when we got there, we discovered that the owner had canceled the service the previous month. Very frustrating. I was in the middle of digital graphics with no internet service. The first night in Yellowstone, we went to eat pizza and to ask where we could get inter internet. The pizza place was kind enough to let us use their service. The only downside was that it was closed at 8 o'clock. My wife and I sat outside the pizza place to work on homework. Once the sun went down, it was cold. The rest of the family went back to the house in the van and left us the truck. But they took the keys with them. It got very cold waiting for them to come back with the keys. Our first full day in Yellowstone took us to the west entrance. We saw a pond made from hot springs, geysers, paint pots that were colored from hot springs water, and Gideon Falls. We left early because the cold front came through and the temperature dropped down to 43 degrees, quite cold for summer. The next day, my other sister-in-law arrived and we went to visit Old Faithful. It was amazing, and more amazing was the fact that we had 22 out of 26 people in the family all together to celebrate my parents' anniversary. The rest of the trip was spent mostly in the van driving around the park. I had no idea how big Yellowstone was. We saw more waterfalls, geysers, hot springs, and wildlife. We got to see buffalo, elk, moose, wolves, and a mama bear with two cubs. The longest day included a trip down Uncle Tom's Trail which had 328 steps down to the bottom of a beautiful waterfall and once at the bottom we had to hike back up those same 328 steps. The one big surprise was the weather. Even though we went in July and August it snowed while we were there. No one had packed anything really warm so we all bought coats in the gift shop. As much as I love my family, riding in the same van for nine days together was not always easy, but I came away with great memories, some excellent photos, and a closer relationship with my family.